Judy and welcome to $5 Friday and we're adding something new to our $5 Friday we're doing a group play with with three other channels so we're going to be doing that on Fridays too and uh, before we get started I want to just welcome you here remind you about the giveaway today's the last day to enter for the giveaway so make sure that you do tomorrow I will be having the video a video up showing how much money I saved in April and where I'm going to put it I'm not getting to put it in as many places as I want, but hopefully I can next time. But anyway, and then uh, on Sunday, we will have our Sunday playing with friends, plus a bonus video, which is going to be the giveaway video. So be on the lookout for that. And another thing before we get started, counting our money for our $5 Friday and our group play, Donna Powered by Creativity <coughs> has given us a challenge. She's given us a challenge to save $1 a day in May, and uh, I just printed it off, so um, I actually owe it two days, three days, I owe it three days. <clears throat> so let's go ahead and get those um, colored in. Let me get some pins here. Let me just get one of these. And I want to start it. I put lotion on my hands, and... They don't want to cooperate with the pins, <laughs> the pin lids. Okay, we'll do a pink flower. <clears throat> a yellow flower. Well, that says it's yellow, but that's green. There's Sharpie nuts. Does that not look like yellow to you? But that's green. <laughs> okay, and then we'll do an orange one. So that's Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. And I've got to try to remember to do them every day. Let me get one of these yellow ones to make a little yellow in the center. So they actually look like a daisy. Okay, and let's, I had two dollars laid out for it, but let's, I've got one back here. And we will put this in here. And I don't actually have a binder that I use for daily. So I'm just going to sit it here. <clears throat> and each day I'll try to remember to put my dollar in there. Okay. So let's count the money and see how much we've got today. How much we've got to use today. I put a little bit more in there than, than I usually do for $5 Friday because we're going to be doing these group plays. So we'll do them and whatever have we, we have left will go into $5 Friday. And what am I cooking today? <clears throat> I'm going to do some baked chicken breast in the oven and some sweet potatoes in the oven. Just ch cut up sweet potatoes with some cinnamon and butter on them. And I'm going to melt some marshmallows on them. And we're going to have some green beans and some homemade rolls. And I am making some chest bars. I had them down to make last week. And then I ended up doing the cherry cobbler instead. Because I wanted some ice cream. <laughs> I just bought some ice cream. I'm kind of an ice cream fanatic. I could eat ice cream for dessert every day not have anything else i'm just that way about ice cream so after i bought that vanilla bean ice cream i thought mm, i gotta have make something to go with that vanilla bean ice cream so i ended up making that cherry cobbler okay so we've got 10 15 20 25 30 35 40 45 50 55 60 65 70 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, $88 today. Normally I set aside $55 for $5 Friday, but I wasn't sure how much these group plays were going to take. So we'll do this those first and we'll see. And I also don't do not have another A5 binder, so I had to get this one out. I'm not real fond of these kind of binders because they 
they don't want to lay down. Let me get my little dice thing right here. There we go. And so I, I ended up putting them away and had bought a couple of others, but I don't have any other um, binders. So we're going to have to use these. Okay, I'm going to do, I'm going to roll, this is actually the April. I haven't gotten the May one yet. I have ordered them. This one is from uh, All Things Kimberly, and I have joined her um, her group play, and she is joining mine, <clears throat> which is my saving, uh, my Sundays playing with friends is my group play, and she's going to be doing it. <clears throat> and I'm doing a group play along with uh, All Things Kimberly. Um, let me see, uh, Ellie on Earth, Elaine Realized, and Gentle Charms, Gentle Charm Budgets, we're doing, I'm going, doing a group play, the four of us are going to be doing the group play, so anyway, I'm going to go ahead and, and work on her April one though, because I have not received the May one yet, so we will go ahead and roll the dice, a six, Okay, we'll put six in here. I might go ahead and do it again and just see if I can finish up the rolls. And a four. So we've got ten that's going in here today. And then next week we will maybe finish off the butterflies and then do those scratchers. So we'll go ahead and put ten in here. And maybe by then I'll have her May one. I'll have to catch up on it though. But she started it today. She started it Wednesday. She's doing hers on Wednesday and I'm doing my on Fridays and then my game is on Sunday. Okay, 10, 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29 dollars in here. And I will put their links to their channels below and please go check out their group play and their freebies that they have on there and play along with us. It would be it's going to be really fun. The other one that Kimberly has for May is one where you roll the dice and it's like you're bowling against her and it's going to be fun. Okay, and then I have the scratcher from Ellie, which she mailed to me for her grip play. So we're going to be scratching one of these today. It's number one. Well, no surprise which one that is. $2. And we're supposed to just do one a week. Let me get my... Okay, so we'll put two dollars in this one. And the next one is from Elaine Realize. And this is her group play kitten. Isn't he cute? She's got the prettiest eyes. This is a tabby. Okay, let's see which one we're going to do. And same thing here. We'll just do one a week. Number one. Six dollars. Be sure and go and check these channels out because all of these are such lovely ladies and I have followed them for quite a while and they follow me too, so I'm so grateful for that. And then this one, let me explain how it's going to go. It's called Let's Play War, and this is the one that's from Gentle Charms. And I've printed off the instructions here because I didn't have an A5 binder. I'm having to fold it. But anyway, what you do, it says you win, money goes to something fun. I win, which is Gentle Charms, something you put the money towards something serious like debt or an emergency fund. Okay, it says first decide where your money goes if you win. Okay, so next roll, next, roll two dice, save that amount, then go check out Gen Gentle Charms Budgets group play to get my score for the week, and don't forget to tell me your score. At the end of five weeks, add up both totals and apply funds to the winner. Okay, so we will roll two dice, see how much we get, and we'll, we will put it right in here, because this is me, and this is her. So then I have to watch her video to see how much to put in here for her. At the end, we add up, and the one that has the most is the winner. If I win, I get to put the money towards something fun. If I lose, I have to put it into debt or emergency fund or something serious like that. So let's do two. 
a one and a five. So I've got six. Okay, so we're going to write down six right here. And I will put in my six dollars. Okay. I think that's going to be fun. And I don't know if I want it to be something serious serious or something fun. Of course, if, I, if it's something serious, that means I lost. <laughs> and I don't like losing. <laughs> okay. And this is a freebie on her channel. Go check it out. Be sure to grab it and play along with us. I'm going to be playing on Friday. And they will be playing on different days. I know that Kimberly says she's doing it on Wednesday. I'm not real sure about Elaine and um, Gentle Charms. Ellie is on Friday. She's Wednesday. Kim's Wednesday. Ellie is on Friday. And I will find out what day these other two will be doing theirs. And I will put it in the description below. Okay. So we will put this binder away. Okay, now let's go to $5 Friday. We're going to be doing our very first tulip in May. And we do have, uh, let me check and make sure. Let's see, one, two, three. No, we have, we have one, two, three, four, five Fridays in May. So we can do one tulip at a time would be fine. Okay, let's do... Maybe purple. This week has flown by for me, has it you guys? What well, has me? It just seems like it's just gone by so quickly. <clears throat> I should have done those as a red tulip, actually. Okay, let me put in my five. Okay, and at the end of April, we ended up with $100, so I went ahead and took out the money I had in there and put a $100 bill in here. Condensed it down. Okay, and then next we're going to put five into Coffee, Please by Kirsty Isolated Funds, at Isolated Funds. So let's cross off another coffee. And add five dollars. We're halfway on this one. We've got five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty. So this will be a sixty dollar savings when we get finished. And the next one is by Donner, Donald Donald. Donna Pine by Creativity, and I just messed up right there because I was supposed to start with her, not the coffee, please. So that's okay. Okay, we are going to be finishing this one. This one has been a long haul, but I've loved it. So we're going to color in the very last circle. And next week, we will, we will replace this with something else. Okay. Let's put in our five. Get our money clip off of here. And let's count our money. 20, 40, 50, 60, 65, 70, 75 dollars. I'm going to ring that bell. Tear this out. This has been one of those that's been a long time finishing. But it's $75, so it was worth it. Let's put down $75 here. And I get to add this with my one that I finished um, on Wednesday from Sarah on a Budget. And that makes us $175 so far for the month of May. Okay, let me set that aside. We'll take out this envelope. Let 
And I will add a dollar to the ding ding envelope. And I do believe this will be the only one we're finishing today. But that's good. I'm so happy to have one done. Okay, and this one we're going to do, this one is from Lisa Grateful Me. I'm sure not a lot of you know, especially newer subscribers, that Lisa, um, she had family that was uh, in the fires over in Maui. And uh, she put this one on her Etsy shop and asked people to go buy it because she was going to donate the money to those people over there, her family that needed the money where they were had the fire. So a whole lot of us got this then, and I'm still working on mine. I had started it, and then fall hit, and I went into the Christmas mode, so just went back and started it over at the first of the year. So let's do... this flower and I'm doing each flower at five dollars each that's what's fun about five dollars Friday because everything is five dollars okay so let's see what we've got Put in five dollars. Okay, we've got 10, 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75 in here. So that is good. Okay, then we have up, up, and away. And I would love to get this finished before we go on vacation, but I don't know that I will. I wanted to, and um, don't think we're going to get to though. Of course, we still don't know exactly when we're going. I planned on going maybe right after school was out, but I don't think we're going to be able to. And Amy's not real sure what they're doing right yet. So I'm kind of waiting to see what their plans are before making some plans of my own. Let's just do this blue. My sister her son that lives in Nashville, he comes up here and gets her and my niece every um, July and takes them to his house for a week or two, and he does the same thing at Christmas. So I don't know, I told Guy maybe it'd be better if I go, we go on vacation the same time that they're gone. I kind of think that that might work out better. So that's what we're contemplating, I don't know. Okay, we've got 10, 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75 dollars in here now. So that, this one's halfway because it's $150 savings. Okay, then we have I Heart You. This one was a freebie back at Valentine's from Hey K Budgets. And we're getting close. We've got just three more. It's a little lagging behind Valentine's Day, but that's all right. Okay, let's see. We now have 10, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65. So this one will also be $75, and we will have it finished for the month of May, so that'll be good. That's three we know for sure will be finished that we have in May. Okay, then we have Flower Power, and this one is from D Plants and Budgets, and this was a freebie that she had on her channel a long time ago, and I got it then, and um, I didn't start playing it till after the first of the year, though. So, let's do, do I have a really pale, pale pink? Let me get this color. Let's do this color. I think this one is really pretty. I think the It and the one, the Aloha from Lisa Grateful Me are probably my two favorite challenges as far as being pretty. 
Dee's another lady that has a spectacular channel, and you need to go check her out. Okay, let's put another five in here. Okay, we've got 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80 dollars in here now. Wow. Wow, wow. You guys got big plans for the weekend? I don't. I, I really, really need to do some spring cleaning is what I need to do. And it seems like I say that every week and then we end up going and doing something or guys say, come on, let's go do this or something. And then I end up not doing what I need to be doing. So I don't know. Hopefully I can get some things done. Okay, five dollars. And so far we've got 5, 10, 15, 20 in this one. And then summer tents. We're going to do five in here. Um, I don't know if this was the pink I had last time or not. Doesn't matter. We'll do a three and a two. And we have five in there, so this makes ten. We used to love to go camping when the kids were younger. Um, when my parents were living, we all did things t together. We had a cabin in the mountains that all the men in my family built. Amy was just a toddler when we would go up there and camp and build, work on that cabin. And then when my parents also had a place at the beach at one of the campgrounds. So all the time when our kids were small, we always had a place to go, whether it was the mountains or the beach or whatever. And when we'd go to the mountains, it wouldn't be just us. It would be my whole family went. We have slept as many as 35 people in the cabin before. <clears throat> we had a Huge, huge family room that had one, two, five sofas in it. It had a big round circular sofa in front of the fireplace. It had a pull-out sofa on this side, a pull-out sofa on this side, one back here behind the pool table and one to the side of the pool table. And then we had two bedrooms and both bedrooms had <clears throat> two big beds and a rollway in them. And we would go and have an absolute ball. And the we were right on the creek, and the, everybody would fish, and we would have the best time. And we used to love to go camping and stuff, too. But as the kids got older, and <clears throat> they got into high school and stuff, and started graduating and going away to school, <clears throat> it made it harder to just do that kind of stuff. And then my dad passed away, and my mom, for a while, we kept trying to take her down to the beach, but... It just got to be such an expense for her and everything that she ended up selling her place at the beach and we sold it. Well, what happened about the cabin, there were some teenagers that broke in up there because it was up in the Cherokee Forest and they uh, actually set it on fire. But So they ended up, um, they took the in, my parents took the insurance money and they ended up installing an in-ground pool at their house, which is just right down at the end of my driveway. Uh, most of the kids were kind of teenagers when that happened. So they all enjoyed the pool for many years. And uh, that's where my son lives now. And uh, so they always made sure that we all had things to do and have a good time too. And I miss all that so bad. Okay, that one's got $10 now. Now we're going to do this one. 
Oh, I didn't tell you who that one was from. That one was, was from Toe Bean Budgets. And this one is from, if I can get it out. This one is from Go Budget Boo. And we'll do another five in here. I think I might do a two and a three this time. Oh, let's see. Mix it up a little bit. Okay, and then we're going to do five into this one from Denise at Living, Living Life at 60-ish. And this is her Etsy store, Fairy, Fairy Rose Cottage. We'll put five in there. Let me see how much I've got left. This will be our last five. This is where we will end. Okay. So we've got 10 in here so far. And we only have $3 left, so we will stop right here. I'll put my little money clip right here, and this is where we will start next week if I don't forget. <laughs> okay. Let's see. We might be able to finish this one up in May. I know we want this one. This one. We will finish this one. We want this one. I don't think we will this one either. We want that one. We might be able to finish this one up in May. I don't know. We'll see. We'll just see how it goes. And I need to add one to replace the one from Donna Powered by Creativity. And we will do that before next week. Actually, I may add... one of these because we haven't I haven't started them yet let's see I put these in the very back I haven't started them we actually could do this one for five dollar Friday and for the tens I could just do half of a ten or could do these for five dollars fr Fridays but it would take a long time to finish that one so I don't know I'll find one to do. I've got a lot of challenges that say $5, so we'll put something in there. So anyway, that's all we have. Don't forget, tomorrow, watch tomorrow for the video for to see how much money I saved in April and what sinking fund it's going into. And then on Sunday, we will have Sunday playing with friends, and I will have a bonus video for the giveaway. So make sure that you watch for those. And until then, remember, I love you. Mm -hmm.